pullover, flat bench, straight arm, thoracic extension. If you're a gymnastic skill seeker looking to improve shoulder flexion and spinal extension, you'll appreciate this pullover variation. You want to use a light weight for this exercise. Three to eight kilos is enough. If you feel any shoulder pain or discomfort during this exercise, try using less weight. You will need a bench and a weight to perform the pullover. Start by lying across the bench with the bottom edge of your shoulder blades on the edge of the bench. This is a good starting place on the thoracic spine, but you can also move further up and down the thoracic spine to target different areas of tightness. Grip a dumbbell between two hands with the thumbs on the inside edge of each weight. When performing the pullover, I suggest you internally rotate the shoulders to increase the stretch on the triceps and lats. Push the weight up as if performing a bench press. Lock the elbows and keep the arms straight. With the feet shoulder width apart and the knees bent at 90 degrees, contract the glutes to lift the hips. Start each rep with the torso parallel to the floor. Retract the shoulders by rounding the upper back and pushing the dumbbell away from the body. As you lower the weight overhead, keep pushing the weight away from the body as far as possible. Keep the hips up as you lower the arms overhead as far as flexibility will allow. Pause here and think about internally rotating the shoulders. Try to turn the armpits out and twist your hands into the dumbbell towards the thumbs. Then drop the hips and arch the thoracic spine to increase the stretch. Contract the muscles in your back to extend the spine while also trying to pull the weight down towards the floor. The greater the arch, the deeper the stretch. Don't forget to breathe. Hold this position for the prescribed time before lifting the hips so the torso is parallel to the floor. Relax the shoulders and lift the weight slightly to take a break between reps. The straight arm thoracic extension pullover can be performed for reps, isometric holds, or a combination of the two. Give it a try and see how you go. If you've got questions, please leave them in the comments. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.